Now, the National Democratic Congress, on the other hand, still insists the MPP held the whole country to ransom by heading to court to challenge the 2012 election results. Great Accra Regional Chairman of the NDC, Ade Koko, in an interview with Joy News, said the greatest reflection is to pray that no such challenge of elections happens in Ghana again. He said, whichever political party loses an election must accept and move on. Ago today, this country was probably plunged into a state of anxiety where you could remember that everybody was behind the television set and the radio sets, and all, all, the whole country was quiet, waiting for the verdict of the Supreme Court. So I think today should rather be a day of reflection that how far have we come since uh, 29 August uh, 2013. And I believe what we are experiencing today, all the turbulences we are experiencing today, is as, as a result of the eight months that we spent in litigating. Today is a day for us to go out to the public, have a discussion, there are so many problems, find how best we can alleviate the problems that are going in the country. So, so I believe that is the best thing that the NDC today will do. We've asked our people to go into the midst of the people, do clean-up exercises and that kind of thing, to, 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 give, to give hope and, 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 and a belief that this country will move forward with the NDC. I am told that the NPP in the Ashanti region, they are mourning to mark the day. Well, they, are, they can choose to mourn. They took the whole people of Ghana, they held us hostage for almost eight months. So they can afford to mourn. We rather want to reflect on what, ha what happened and how we should not allow this to happen again. And that after every election, people should know to how to accept victory. Whether you lose or you win, you must allow the system to move on.